Hello everybody, Element12 here, and I have another unboxing video! Woo! -hoo, yay! Last time, if you haven't seen my last unboxing video, I'll put a link in the description where you can watch it. But pretty much last time, I ordered from a website called blueboxtees.com, where they did a Doctor Who t-shirt grab bag thing for $8, and I believe like $4 for shipping. You can get like a random shirt out of a collection of a whole bunch of shirts. And that was really cool. And I liked it a lot. And I got the really awesome one. I don't know where it is. It's in... Actually, no, wait. Hold on. Hold on. I still have it right here. Um, if you haven't watched it, go down there. If you haven't watched it, I'm going to spoil it right now. I got this really cool shirt that looks like the Daft Punk album, but it's like a Dalek and a Cyberman. Anyway, <clears throat> I've got this video because about a few weeks ago, they did another one. And this time they had an option between two. They had a Doctor Who one and a random non-Doctor Who geek one. So I did the random non-Doctor Who geek one and I have the package right here. You can see. Oh, let me adjust the camera first. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay, right here. I got it. So, blueboxtees.com. Ooh. Okay. That's a website. I'm going to probably put a link in there. And I'm going to, I have it prepared, I'm not going to pay it, it open myself. So I have a pair of scissors. So I'm going to do this all one-handed because skills, eh, 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 okay. I wonder what it is. I hope it's something really cool. Like a, like half of them I got, half of the, a good chunk of them I didn't actually understand. So hopefully it's a shirt of something that I like. Eh, eh. Okay, I think I got it. Okay. Let's see what we got here. <laughs> it's blue. I can see that right now. It's a large. I ordered large because I lost weight. Last time I got an extra large, but and this is receipt, whatever. I got large because I lost a lot of weight. And I've been buying extra large. I'm so used to buy extra large. I'm like, you know what? I'm just gonna buy a large because I lost weight. I got. What do we got here? Welcome to the fabulous. What is it? Most. Ooh, the fabulous Mos Esley tattoo. Oh, that's the bar. Isn't that the bar from Star Wars? Where's it? That's pretty cool. Nothing amazing. I was hoping. I'll be honest. I'm a. I wouldn't say disappointed. This is still pretty cool. I like it. Um, I will be honest. I liked. I had a lot. I got a better grab with the Doctor Who one. Cause I'm, I'm slightly more of a. Like I said, I love Doctor Who. I like Star Wars a lot when I was a kid. Most Isley. Isley? Esley? I think it's Isley. I don't know. Still a pretty cool shirt though. I'm not complaining. 12 bucks or 12 25 actually. I have the receipt right here. I'm going to look. I'm going to read it. Um, yeah. $8. Four for, four twenty five for shipping. So the whole thing is twelve twenty five. That's the exact same price as it was the same. So if you have exactly $12.25 lying around and you want a nifty cool random shirt. I say do this. This is this is really cool. I like it. I saw there's an Okami one where I had like a Matarasu or Mataras as like the the Doge meme, and I thought that was really funny. So I was hoping for that, but <coughs> excuse me, I still have a slight cold. Um, this one's still pretty cool too. So not disappoint, not completely disappointed. Um, I will say this one, the Daft Punk is a lot cooler. The I give it a 5 out of 5 just for the awesomeness. This one's okay. I'll definitely wear it. If I... I know a few guys who... That's the problem. is not a huge amount of my friends are into Star Wars that much, so... I gotta find a cool time to wear this one. But there's a design. You can see it. Welcome to the fabulous most Isley. Esley. I don't know. I haven't watched freaking Star Wars in forever. Tatooine. When I saw Tatooine, I was like, there you go. That's cool. I'm not exactly... Like I said, I'm not upset. This is a really cool shirt. I love these deals. I was vaguely hoping for a better one, but this is still pretty cool regardless. But anyway, here's the other shirt. I mean, actually, I'm gonna fold the other shirt out just so we can get a comparison of these two shirts. There's this one, and there's a. I wear black. I love black shirts, so I'm naturally a guy who will like the black shirt a lot more than I'd like the other blue shirt. But this is a personal preference. This is a cool shirt. If you're obviously if you're a Star Wars fan, you'll definitely love this. And this is Doctor, I'm a Doctor Who fan a lot. Slightly more than Star Wars, so so I was hoping for like a video game one, but this is pretty cool. Uh, I don't know, if I keep I might just keep doing this every time they have one available. I'll, I'll probably just keep doing this because it's really freaking cool. I love these shirts. Even though I'm freaking look at my freaking chair. This is my desk chair. 
Just freaking running out of freaking room for shirts. But I'll keep doing it because I freaking love these shirts. These shirts are really cool. Only 12 bucks. Um, I don't know if they're going to offer another one or just maybe another website might offer it. I don't know. I'm not sure that. But um, if they offer another one, like another Doctor Who one or a non Doctor Who one, I'll do that. I'll probably do another Doctor Who one next time because this is like my only Doctor Who shirt. I have like a few other like Doctor Who things. Like I have, I have like the fourth Doctor scarf and stuff. But it's only my, my only Doctor Who related thing. And this one's just kind of alright, so I think I'm just, I like the Doctor Who one a bit more. I think the thing about the non-geek one is it's it's what, basically the theme is Doctor Who or non-Doctor Who. And basically, I feel like that's... There's a good view. You need both shirts. I feel like the only problem with like just having Doctor Who and non-Doctor Who is it's too like varied. Like, Doctor Who, it's like, if you like Doctor Who, for the most part, like maybe 90% of the time you're going to like what you get. And maybe there's a 10% chance you might get a shirt that's like either girly or a reference to another like video game or TV show you never heard of. But for the most part, it's still going to be Doctor Who, so you're still going to like it. For the non-Doctor Who, this random geek one, I feel like it's too vague. Like there's like, I saw like Mario stuff, Zelda stuff, Okami. I love Okami, so that one got me pumped. And like random like Star Wars, Star Trek, Ghostbusters, so many different things. I feel like that one's too like vague. Like, Doctor Who, it's like, yeah, you're getting a Doctor Who shirt. There you go. Non-Doctor Who, you can get almost anything. That's why I felt interested about it. It's like, I don't know what I'm going to get. So I got, like, basically Star Wars, which is kind of cool. I like it because it's not obviously a Star... It's not a really obvious Star Wars shirt. Like, if you were just walking in a crowd and people weren't paying attention, you'd probably think you're just wearing a generic Las Vegas shirt. But if somebody's, like, a real nerd and they see that, they'll go, Oh, yeah, I get what you're wearing there. That's pretty cool. I would say they should make, like, genres, like video game grab bags, or like anime grab bags, or sci-fi grab bags, or Star Wars, Star Trek grab bags. Just like how they do the Doctor Who grab bags. But then again, the website is uh, Blue Box Tees, which obviously Blue Box is a Doctor Who thing, and they have Doctor Who shirts, so... The main focus is Doctor Who, I dig it. I dig it a lot. The shirt's still pretty cool. I'll be honest, I've, like I said, there's worse shirts I've had, the better shirts i had, which is this one. Next time I will probably get a Doctor Who grab bag. But um, I don't want to ramble too long, so... I'm gonna cut it right. I'm gonna cut it right here. So, this is twelve signing off. This awesome shirt. I don't know. This shirt like a five out of five. Five out of five. This shirt probably about a three out of five. Like it's cool. I was like, I was hoping for an Okami one. There was a Okami one that I really liked, which I hope I can get somewhere else if I can't get in the grab bag. But oh well, this is twelve signing off. I'll see you guys later. Peace.